Hey. Hey, hey. Antenna is looking so fine. We are getting ready for the wedding. Oh my yes. god, Saint Mara did wonders. You can't tell me anything. She's looking so beautiful. Yes. Say hello, Saint Mara. <laughs> so guys, I'm getting ready. Cynthia is helping me pack my hair. You can see her mama is making antennas. Beating her face, <laughs> and Cynthia is over here trying to make my hair look, you know, presentable at least. This is the first time I'm actually sitting on a makeup chair. Seriously, I have never sat on a makeup chair before. And see me here in my sister's house. My sister Saint Mara is a celebrity makeup artist. Yes, sir. Yes, so I'm sitting on her seat, her makeup seat. So guys, watch out for me. I'm not really doing me, so much. Makeup. I just want her to, you know, put up a foundation and eyelash, and I'm good to go because this wedding, I don't want to go late. Mm, Until like going to the wedding late. Okay, guys. So ciao. Hello, guys. Welcome once again to my YouTube channel. How are you all doing today? I hope you all are doing well. So today is officially the first wedding I am going for the year. Like it has been a long time I went for a wedding. Like I can't really remember the last time I went for a wedding. So if you're watching this video and your wedding is close by, please invite me. I will come. Like like for a while, like I keep staying at home even on Saturdays without doing anything. So I am super excited for this one. One is is the first wedding for the year. I'm attending it. the first wedding and the first wedding that I'm attending in a long while. Like I feel that I've not attended wedding for I don't know how long. So I'll be taking you guys along. So it's a wedding vlog, yeah. So who is doing this wedding? You might ask me. Actually, it's my mother's cousin. The son that is maybe my second cousin. So if I'm if I'm right, my second cousin is actually the one wedding today so i am going all the way from ibejuleki to Festac. you can imagine how long the journey is if you live in lagos you will know how long this journey is but this wedding is very important that i attend the wedding yes because this guy has helped me so much so so much so i need to grace his wedding that's why i am going all out you can see how nice my face is looking like i didn't want so much because there is no time but you saw my auntie's own she took her time to actually make my auntie up but for me because we are running out of time i just told her biko rub me powder rub me powder let me be going i don't want so much so much stuff and already i am i love this you can see i'm wearing eye large i love the look seriously my sisters they have been complaining about my hair that i don't take care of my hair and from today i've decided to you know be very intentional about the way i handle my hair like she has given me a uh, what's it called edge control she actually dashed me her own so from today every day if i want to go out i will seriously pack my hair so that at least i will look good looking good looking good does not really take much but it's actually you need to make out time to look good if you want to look good you need to make out like little time you don't even need plenty time to look good seriously so i'm very intentional about that so these are my nails i fixed these nails yesterday yes and it's looking so fine the nails are looking so fine so how do you rate my makeup she did not she, in fact she was complaining that she was supposed to be i didn't even rub what's it called eyebrow she didn't do my eyebrow at all this is my natural eyebrow yes i did micro blading but that was two years ago or thereabouts so you can imagine so that's it so i'll be taking you guys along when we get there it's actually raining and you guys know my fear about rain my fear about rain is that whenever it rains in lagos oh boy there will be a lot of traffic but man i'm out already and i've decided that i will be going for this wedding i don't even want to be discouraged about it i am out that i and i've made up my mind that oh boy this my makeup cannot go to waste yes and we're already out for crying out loud so yeah 
we've left my sister's place and we are going and so far so good the rain started very heavy like very very heavy but i feel that it's reducing i feel that the rain is going down so and i caught somebody I mean, my sister caught somebody at mainland and they said it's not raining there that the weather quite that, that the weather changed but it has not started raining i just pray that it will not rain at all because i want i want this wedding to be all fun for me like i want to have the whole fun you know yeah so i will take you guys along so we'll see you guys when we get there i love you all and if you're not yet subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for please click on that subscribe button subscribe to my channel like my videos share my videos and tell a friend to tell a friend to, to subscribe to this channel okay guys so let's go there so we are at state mainland bridge so guys i am still on the way <laughs> still on the way we actually missed our okay. road we missed the road in fact today i had to find myself a mine 12. i don't know how that happened but we are almost close from what my google map can, is telling me we are almost close we are heading to my two right now so one thing one bad thing about missing road in lagos let me touch guys one bad thing about missing road in Lagos is if you miss road in Lagos, you might end up finding yourself in another state. If you don't, if you are not careful, it's that bad. Imagine me from all the way from Ibejuleki, Ten Menland Bridge, heading to Festag, and I missed my road to find myself at my 12th. Like how? That's by the way. It's after 12 already. Um, so we are heading to um, what's it called? We are heading to Second Rainbow because I want I want us to enter through Second Rainbow. Yes. So I'll still carry you guys along. It's scary to this road in Lagos, guys. Like I was all over my mind. I was like, so I dressed up. I dressed up with, with this my beautiful self and my beautiful clothes I'm wearing. I'll show you guys my full outfit. I was like, so. I will with this see traffic that I'm at um, Sele. I don't know if if you're conversant with Lagos, you know where Sele is. Sele is actually a, a popular place. Sele is quite a popular place. So I'm at I'm at that place. So the traffic is. I don't think this is a traffic. I think they are doing the road, so they block some parts of the road. And you guys know how Lagos road can be, especially on a raining day. It's crazy, but we'll get there. Let me quickly put my camera into my bag. You know how risky it is to carry this thing on Lagos traffic road, okay? So see you guys. <laughs> so guys, my auntie decided to stop um, at Cody's to buy her cream. So we're already in Apple Junction. So where we are going is actually very close. So finally, we got we got the address. They sell clothes and whatnot. I don't know the name of the shop anyway, but Auntie Kudi, yes, I know Kudi. So we stopped at Kudi Cosmetics to buy her cream. I think that's the only store she buys her cream. <laughs> Alright. So we are going. Going, 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 going. It's still ready. <laughs> it's still ready. Or... <laughs> oh God. So it's still raining, guys. So I just got to the wedding venue. Like, <laughs> so. Oh. So I'll be showing you guys the couple. So.
that <laughs> I went for a wedding and I did not really show you guys anything and I am going like seriously because we missed our way so we came in so late like it's not that we came in late we actually came in at the right time when they were snapping picture and I had to I even snapped picture but I didn't use my camera to snap it so that was that so um I didn't really you know video anything so much because we need to get home today is a raining day and lagos traffic is mad like so that for us to get home on time we decided to leave now i have my food my auntie actually packed our food our takeaway she has given us um what's it called um we ate meat you guys saw the meat we ate yes and chops i didn't eat chops but we ate the meat and the meat it's very 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 yummy like they spiced it so well i love it i enjoyed myself and another thing okay they gave us gifts they gave us gifts and we i didn't buy gifts so i actually gave envelope like we gave envelope my auntie and i gave my auntie envelope so that's it and you guys see how happy they are you see that i i i i interviewed them and they were so happy like the truth is when we give birth we nurture them and this moment means so much to every parent like when your child finally is you know marrying to so, you know start a family like it's a beautiful thing and we're actually happy for them like very happy for them and we pray that you know the marriage will be as successful as ever like they will enjoy and they will be blessed children will round down round their table that's my prayers for them what again okay so we are going i just pray that the road will obey themselves obey obey so let me see what i have okay so this is the gift this is the gift they gave us it's beautiful they i think they call it souvenir mm -hmm. souvenir and they gave me oh my god this is wine so i'll be drinking this when i get home yes because you know we didn't have time to you know shop and everything there's one thing they did i noticed they did they shared the um, menu menu they shared menu uh, um on the tables you don't need to come to where they are serving food you will just stick you what put you salt in, yes stick what you want and they will bring it to you which is a very good one and another thing they want to do is that the the bride's family will dance in then That's the groom's cool. family will dance in before the couples and their bridesmaid and groomsmen groomsmen will come come over and it's, it's 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 such a beautiful thing seriously I, I love that i think i've not i've not gone to a wedding and you know they do that i have not and another thing they don't want people to spray them yes they don't want people to spray them i wish i stayed mm -hmm. but i can't they don't know spreading out. of money if you they have fake money they are they printed some you know some cards you will spread them when you go for the card you will transfer the money into their account so you're not spreading the real money mm. which is a beautiful idea you know because I, I i believe that if you are in nigeria when the naira scarcity was there 
and um, people um, there's one person that uh, got into trouble because of spreading money so people are actually very careful when it comes to spraying money um, in parties in weddings you know but I'm happy that I actually went out and I saw my auntie people that I've not met that the husband I've not seen the man before he has heard so much about me and it's a beautiful thing that we are meeting for the first time today so I'm feeling myself I'm feeling beautiful and I'm happy that I went out to see people because I met people that you know they know my mom or they, they know me like when they see my face they say ah that is Kate's sister Kate's um, daughter but they don't they've not seen me before so it's a beautiful thing to meet families because if you have weddings <laughs> invite me I will come with all my heart I will come home. like I'm happy that I went out distance can be crazy like Lagos Lagos distance can make you not enjoy yourself seriously but it's okay nothing spoil you understand nothing spoil but it is well Lagos traffic can make you miss weddings I went to drop my daughter on a Saturday and I met wedding people that day the mad traffic and I met wedding people on the road on the road wedding people that went for wedding on the road by by three they've not got into the venue that is what Lagos Road mm -hmm. that is the kind of thing Red Lagos Road can do to you so you can actually live in Lagos with your cousins but distance can make you not see them but I thank God for phone and I actually thank God for I think video call is a beautiful idea <sighs> like yeah if you're very close to someone you have to do a lot of video calls if you live in Lagos believe me from my area to Festa will take you two hours without traffic today it took me how many hours <laughs> I, I don't know we left Cynthia the place by 10 Yes, we missed road. That is the problem. Yeah, we missed road. It would have been less than that because the road was not so bad at the end of the day. There but was not much traffic. The traffic wasn't much. I was expecting because of the the rain that traffic would be so much. But at the end of the day, the traffic was not even much. It wasn't much. Yes, it wasn't much because like it took us less than that. Imagine us missing the road and at the end of the day we still got here by one. Right or two. We got here by two. Oh boy, my time is not even correct. We got here by two. Eh? How can I wear wristwatch and it's not working and I didn't know? Thank God for phone watch. <laughs> Thank God for what? Like seriously, eh? I really enjoyed myself. It's fine. I didn't I didn't waste time. You know? But I I, I love the feeling that I dressed up and I went to a wedding and I entered a hall well decorated. You understand and i saw couples like very young people getting married is a beautiful thing hope you guys enjoy the small small clips here and there that i showed you i hope you enjoyed it because man like there was nothing i could do we got to go you know with that family you don't want to sleep on the road because you guys have been hearing of late people as on thursday thursday last week people actually stayed on the road till 3 a.m I don't want that for myself okay I don't like late nights whatever I don't night stops are not for me seriously so presently we are at uh, my two so let me show you guys what my two looks like if you don't know this is Lagos my two this is what Lagos my two it looks like I already met my two yes this is what's this called Mr. Moses first gate, first gate. okay we at first gate first tag and uh, this, this is how it looks the, the other side is the first gate and we are just getting this is doba they call this place doba 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 <laughs> the other side of it not that side though. not this side though you know we are going so it's not this side guys this side. it's not this side so we are, we are heading to orile because we want to connect va orile see the road if it rains in lagos <laughs> you will know that lagos gutters are for fancy <laughs> lagos gutters uh, for fancy there is nothing you can tell me this is an express so like i said <laughs> seriously jokes are fat lagos um gutters are for fancy there is nothing you can tell me this road is not up to 10 years yes this road i don't want to like say it's less than or it's less than five years 
But let's say this road, this very road, is not up to 10 years. The, 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 the gutters are not working. Like, <laughs> the gutters are all blocked. Blocked to the beginning, brim. Is they're not working. Huh? If you're in Lagos, no only God could help us, seriously, because it's crazy. You know, people say Lagos is like, you know, those days when we yeah, when we are growing up, because I grew up in the East. When somebody tells you, I mean, Lagos, like, it's a big deal for us. We, we used to think that Lagos is like Obodo Ibu abroad. Seriously. A lot of people still think that way. But seriously, if I have an opportunity to leave Lagos to any other coast city, I wouldn't mind. You understand? I wouldn't mind because what and what are you facing? The roads are crazy. The traffic, the traffic's are mad. The traffic's are very mad. Like it's crazy. At times you end up being on traffic for hours. Hours, I mean five hours. Have you been on traffic for five good hours? Seriously, Lagos Road can do that. So that's what we are facing. So when you see me, hello. When you see me, uh, and you know, you feel that Chima is in Lagos and she's afternoon. enjoying. No, you are the one enjoying. If you live in Abuja, you actually enjoy. You don't know what God has done for you. I mean, Lagos stress. Mm. We all know oh, wonder, yeah, God, yeah. what stress yeah. can actually do to one's health. Like okay. stress. Stress can actually shorten your life. That's so how bad. Anom to, anom stress is. Is. This is jokes okay. apart. Lagos is not actually okay. a good place to live. I'm not gonna come here to say it is. No. Imagine me. I went for a wedding. Eh? I stayed hours on road. Then I got to the wedding, the very wedding, and I stayed only 30 minutes so that I can go fast and go home to my family. That's what Lagos does to you. Lagos will make you not even see your family like you live in the same city with your family you don't ever see them because Lagos traffic imagine those days if there is no phone eh? what we want to do we'll start writing letter will this letter get to that person <laughs> this Lagos road no go allow letter get to you if I write to you Lagos road you no go go Seriously, I'm looking so beautiful. I know. You don't need to tell me. I know I'm beautiful. So guys, I just got home and you can't believe that it's 6 o'clock. Like it's 6 o'clock and I'm home. Seriously, living in Lagos is very stressful. If you, Especially if you have functions outside the area you live. The situation, the traffic, every damn thing is crazy. Like really, really crazy and it's not funny. Imagine like... I left my house to go for a wedding and I stayed like five hours going and coming and I was able to stay in the wedding the function I went for for only 30 minutes so that I will get home on time who does that Lagos is stressful my people Lagos is very stressful so guys thank you so much for always supporting Chiwa Glory I appreciate every one of you God bless you if you are not yet subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for Click on that subscribe button, subscribe to my channel, like my videos, share my videos, and tell a friend to tell a friend to what? To subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys in my next video. I love you all. Bye.